Good morning. I have three announcements I wanted to share with everyone. First, our rabbinical search committee has been hard at work. It started out as a group of 25 divided into three groups. They spent the summer cobbling together our application packet, each group with their own set of tasks. After a lengthy review by the board, staff and the search committee, our application packet was submitted to the URJ just after Yom Kippur. I'm happy to announce we have three candidates we are considering. A smaller group led by Emily Albano has conducted our first round of interviews. This week, staff and lay leaders will meet the three candidates for a second interview, and we will all reconvene after Thanksgiving for next steps. Second, our executive director search is coming to a conclusion with our candidate flying in to visit Beth Tor the weekend of December 1. He will join us for Shabbat services both Friday night and Saturday. On Sunday, December 3, he will join us at a Tikkun KC work party so we can meet in a more casual atmosphere and he can see one of our social action projects firsthand. That leads to my third announcement. Our favorite affordable housing nonprofit, Tikkun KC, has partnered with Footprints, a homeless veteran support nonprofit. Beth Torres' Andy Asher is part of the Footprints admin team and will serve as our contact in coordinating this partnership. Tikkun KC will provide an ongoing pipeline of housing opportunities for both apartment buildings and single-family homes for Footprints homeless veteran clients. Beth Tor, along with other area synagogues, will have regular opportunities to be involved in the planning and implementation of job site work parties, food and clothing drives, helping with support services, and many other social action projects for this worthy veterans group. Takoon Casey is presently renovating an apartment building at 27th and Van Brunt for the veterans. The building will also have a day room available for caseworker visits and other professionals. Mental wellness issues also plague these veterans as well as not having a roof over their head, so this will allow their support professionals to come to them. It's much easier and more efficient for both. Sign up information for the work party will be listed in the weekly five things to know over the next several weeks. I will continue to keep everyone updated as we wind our way through the rabbi search process, finalizing our executive director hire, and another big social action program announcement still in the planning stages. All for now, so please mark your calendars and join us for Shabbat services on December 1 and the Tikkun Work Party on December 3rd. Thank you.